this is the command window for the octave GUI. Here we will just simply write a equals to 15. It will declare a variable name a and the value of a is 15. Here we have not specified what is the data type of a. It will automatically create the variable and this is the workspace. Here you can see the variable and the variable type is class double. We can check here also if we type who's a on the time it will display the, all the details about the variable a. Here you can see the variable name is a, class is double, size is 8 bytes, size is basically 1 by 1. Everything in the octave is treated as a matrix. So this is 1 by 1 matrix. The type is double. Now if I declare another variable b equals to 20. Here I am not using semicolon. What happened? Here b equals to 20. I can see the value of b immediately just after executing the command. So semicolon is used to suppress the output immediately. Now suppose I am declaring another variable c. c equals to a plus b. Again I am not giving the semicolon that means it will show the output immediately. So c equals to 70. So we use semicolon to suppress the output. Now suppose I have declared some variables. I can reuse it for different purpose also. Suppose if I am using e equals to welcome. So I am assigning some string on a let's see. What is the data type of a? Who's a? Now, now the variable class is char means it is the character size 1 by 7. It is again matrix. Now size automatically changes, types automatically changes. So in Octave or the MATLAB, we can use variables for different purpose, same variable for the different purpose. Now suppose I want to delete that particular variable from the workspace. For this purpose, we have to use clear command. C L E A R clear A. That means it will clear the variable from the workspace. So here you can see we have deleted the variable A from the workspace. Now if I want to clear all the variables on the time, we have to use clear all. So it will clear all the variables from the workspace. Now if I want to clear this command window, we have executed many commands, now I want to clear it. Just like the clear screen in C. Here if we write CLC, that means clear the command window. So here you can see all the previous commands that you have executed is deleted. This can be done from here also. Edit clear command window, clear command history, clear workspace. So by using this uh, menu, you also can delete the clear the workspace, you can delete the command history, you can delete the command window. So here if I click on this, on the time, this command history window, all the history has been deleted.